Good morning to everyone. First of all, let me say I thank everyone for joining us. It's only the right and the privilege of this city and the leadership of this city to address our citizens of uh, Phoenix City, and that's what we're doing. And we're so grateful to be a part of a great country and a great city. However, we wanted to let our citizens know that we are following everything from this COVID-19, uh, this coronavirus that we have occurred in this country all over this world. And I do want everyone to know this is something that is uh, we haven't seen in the history of this country, but I do know this. We are doing everything we can to make sure that this disease does not continue to spread. We are following the exact order from the federal government, from our state, and our local government to do everything to ensure our citizens that we are in the line with all of us and all of you to make sure that we continue to protect the citizen of our state and more importantly at this time in our community and county. I am just so grateful that you all have put the confidence in us to be able to lead you and I do know that with the social distancing that we are going through I want us to know it may separate us face to face but I can assure you that our leadership team and the people of this community as you see standing behind me, our city manager, our assistant city manager, as well as our chief of police and as well as our emergency management, Bob Franklin, we are going to stay connected to this community as form of communicating, doing all the marquees out there for everyone that can see that. We also have created a website that, that, that's going to be updated constantly as things come to us. And that website is Phoenix City AL dot us forward slash COVID-19. So if you have any questions or anything, feel free to call any of us down here, but also go to that website that will constantly be updated, keeping you informed. Because the number one responsibility of the leadership of this community and of this city and this county is the safetyness of all our citizens. And I do want to ensure you that we are doing everything on the order that's come down from the federal government and the state as I stated before. There are some changes that we're making. There are some mission critical things that we can't shut down, but there are also some issues of uh, uh, departments that will shut down as far as things that we don't consider mission critical like the library, the courts, parks and rec gyms and things like that. But when we come to the day-to-day -day operation of the safetyness of our people, wastewater treatment, the fire and chief policemen, those apartments will be open because we are taking this very seriously and we want you to have and maintain the confidence in us that we're doing everything that we're supposed to do. And if you have any questions, again, feel free to call us. But also, we want to assure you that we're going to stay connected to our community through our communication of emails, through our marquees, to the website. So we may not be connected face to face, but I promise you, we are going to stay connected to you because this is something that is unlike anything that we've seen in the history of this world, in this country. But I do want to assure you that I do believe wholeheartedly that we are going to step up as leaders of this country and I do promise you as leaders of this city, we're going to step up and make sure we keep you foremost safe and also showing that we are going to maintain our integrity to do what is best for our citizens. Thank you all so much. We appreciate you all. And I'm going to ask that anyone up here, Bob, anything you want to say? Mr. Hunter? Chief? We're good. You pretty much said it. But again, safetyness and taking care of our people is the number one thing. Thank you all so much.